Harvard professor has a history of being a prick at restaurants. Looks like the Harvard business professor, who made national headlines for threatening a Chinese restaurant with legal action when it overcharged him $4 on his $53 meal, has a history of being a total prick. Ben Edelman previously attacked a sushi restaurant when they refused to apply his Groupon coupon toward their prefix menu. I call on you to honor my three Osushi Groupon vouchers. I also call on you to extend their validity for six weeks to reflect the day imposed by a resolution of this dispute. Edelman wrote in an email to the now-closed Osushi. He further threatened to whine to the City of Boston Licensing Board, which he warned could take away their liquor license. Osushi responded by banning Edelman from ever stepping foot in the restaurant again and threatened to call the cops if he ignored the warning. You should be ashamed of yourself and the business practices you exhibit. In effect, trying to make a business lose money and trying to make someone bend to ridiculous claims you seem to feel strongly about, the restaurant wrote. They reminded him that he was getting a refund on his Groupon voucher, a decision they agreed with because no one in retail should have to deal with someone whose ego is as large as yours. More importantly, Edelman can't know too much about business if the guy's paying $53 for cheap Chinese takeout. Extra action, extra insanity, extra perversion, extra mayhem. Tomanews.net.